think I'm gonna relocate this one. I'm not really sure how he's gonna make it if I don't, but he's too big right now to pinch off and move. I think the best idea is to put another plant in here to cover him up. I'm not sure. Yeah, well. a Henry Dulberg I could put in here to cover you up. I hope that works. I'm not sure. Well, there's the first wall on my office. Needless to say, Norman is amazing. But there was never any doubt about that. Now I was there. Alright, all three of these girls have eggs on them. Lori and I were at Farm Patch yesterday and we actually saw the eggs being laid. Pretty amazing. So, I have to find a place for them where there are no predators. Those are my spice trees. And this is a true story. The spice tree is the host plant for the spiced butterfly. No kidding, Google it. And that's all my blue mist I need to plant. That is the exact same grapevine I bought my niece Lily, and last time I checked it was still growing. Anyway. This is a teasing Georgia. 
Got the teasing Georgia going up. And this is an awakening. Henry Goldberg Sage is doing its thing. That is bee balm. A lot of bee balm. That's blue mist crowded down there with uh, a shrimp plant. It's probably going to get eaten alive. And I should have... Well, see, I can't protect them out here either. I don't know where those flies are coming from. They're killing everything. So at this point, I have no idea if I have eastern volatile butterflies at all. Not unless they're hiding somewhere. This is Henry Goldberg Sage. That's Gara. This is Purple Skullcat. Again with the yeah, blue mist flower. <laughs> yeah, keep them on talking. Blue mist flower over there. Chili pekin. That real pretty thing right there, like that. That's Greg's mist. And the pink is Gara. And the purple is Homestead verbena. I mean, I still don't see my swallowtail. Caterpillars, which is very irritating. They're not there. And they're not down here either. That's alarming. That pretty pink thing is Autumn Sage. That is Rue, Montana, and Windy Fish. It's been a long day and I really don't feel like mowing, folks. But you know what? Life goes on. That's getting black spot. And all that needs water. She has to be pegged, which is a genuine pain in the bum and half the nose. It's irritating. I don't have time to mow. I need to plant. All these are Lily and Kelly's except for the 